Hi boys and girls, it's time to get started with our math. We're doing, doing the end of the chapter review, which is going to count as the test. And I am going to be walking you through some of this, so I want everybody to be following along with me. And you're going to need a pencil and some paper, and you're going to be coloring in some squares and some circles, <clears throat> and some of these things are on in your book. So I want you to go to page 551. So I'm going to read the problem and then I'm going to show you what I've drawn and I'm going to have you draw some things too. Number one, Alexa and Rose read books that have the same number of pages. Alexa's book is divided into eight equal chapters. Rose's book is divided into six equal chapters. Each girl has read three chapters of her book. Write a fraction to describe what part of the book each girl read. Then tell who read more pages. So I've taken some circles here and I've got Alexa's name above one and Rose's name above the other. And I already wrote the fractions in. So we know that Alexa's circle is going to be broken up into eight equal pieces and Rose's will be broken up into six equal pieces. So I'm going to do that right now and you do the same. Do you have something that looks about like this? And if we count, we see that we have eight pieces here and six pieces here. And we are considering those to be equal pieces. So now, the next thing I would do is shade in three of Alexa's pieces and three of Rose's pieces. I shaded in three out of eight pieces here, and I shaded in three out of six pieces. Fewer pieces, but each piece is bigger. So now we're going to look at what the question is asking us again. Write a fraction to describe what part of the book each girl read. Then tell who read more pages. So write the fraction for Rose, for Alexa, she read 3 out of 8. Write the fraction for Rose, she read 3 out of 6. And then tell me who read more pages. So write Alexa or Rose. Number 2. And if I'm going too fast, don't worry about it. You can stop this video and replay it any time. Number two, David, Maria, and Simone are shading same-sized index cards for a science project. David shaded two-fourths of his index card. Maria shaded two-eighths of her index card. And Simone shaded two-sixths of her index card. So I'm going to make some index cards. That are the same size. David, Maria, and Simone. I know David shaded two-fourths of his. So I'm going to shade two-fourths. First I'm going to break it up into four equal pieces. Look at David's, and I'm going to shade two of those. Two out of four. Now for Maria, I'm going to cut this into eight 
equal pieces. I have eight equal pieces. I'm going to shade two out of eight. That's what Maria has shaded. And Simone has shaded two sixths. So I'm going to cut her shape or her index card into six equal pieces. And I'm going to shade two of those. 